Hello everyone, welcome to Mahagurus. In this video, we will learn how we can use magic tools in Canva. Now Canva recently introduced their two magic tools, which is Magic Eraser and Magic Edit. Both have different uses, which we will cover in this video. Uh, first of all, what is, you know, Magic Eraser? Magic Eraser is basically, you know, erase the image uh, from its background. So let's say you want to remove this pen from the background, you can do it. And second is Magic Edit. So you can replace this object with something else. Let's say you have this food and you want to replace with a lot of bananas. So you can do that, right? Uh, there's a disclaimer. So you can't use any of these tools in the free version. You need to have pro membership, pro Canva membership to be able to use it. Second, the quality is not at, as good as Midjourney and you know Adobe Firefly because those are kind of industry leaders. So you can't compare them with Canva. Canva is you know kind of it's for you know pre like a template and everything like that. So let's get started. We'll try the magic eraser first. Uh, it only works in image, both the tools. It only works in image. You can't use this, you can't apply this, you know, tools in text or, you know, any other elements like shapes, frames. You can't use on that. You can't use on that because uh, it only works in images or the pictures. So you need to select the picture first. Click on edit photos. Here you can see magic eraser and magic edit. Now let's try to remove these pen, not these, but just this pen, the, the metal one, from the background or from the tabletop. Click on magic eraser. Now you need to select the pen with this brush. Select it. And leave the cursor. It takes few seconds to process. So once it's done, you can see the results. Okay, so as you can see, it's done, but there's a little patch of the shadows over here. Uh, as I told you, the quality is not good as mid journey. Maybe you can apply one more, you know, uh, one more, try this one more time and maybe the shadows. Let's see if it works. It works. So yeah, you need to put some extra effort, but it works. But it only works when the background is kind of, you know, a really, you know, plain backgrounds it doesn't work when the background is like a flowers or a sky or you know it only works when the background is really simple and very plain a solid background right so now let's work on the you know this part so i want to replace these foods with a lot of bananas let's say so select this object or the image click on image edit okay okay Select this object image and then click on edit photos, click on magic edit and then increase the brush size depending on your requirements. So I'm going to mark the portion which I want to replace with something else. I want to mark it really carefully so that it doesn't cross the bowl and it's done. Okay, click on continue and you can write the description of whatever you know you want to replace it with. I'm going to write bananas. Click on generate. And even this tool takes a few times, you know, all the AI stuffs. It takes a few time, a few seconds. And uh, the good thing is the quality of this tool is much better than the previous one. Right. Oh, wow. So you can see the bananas and some. I don't know what it says, but you get raw bananas, you get bananas with some berries, you know. So you get four different versions like mid journey, right? But these are not as realistic as, you know, the results that I expect, but kind of okay, right? Click on done, the, after selecting one, just click on done. Let's say I'm selecting this and then click on done. Once you're done, it will be applied like this. So this way, guys, you can use magic tools of Canva. Hope you really like this video. If you really like this video, then please make sure you're subscribed to the channel and press the bell icon. And you can check uh, playlist of Canva for more such videos. Thank you.